As Australia gears up to receive its first batch of AH-64E Apache helicopters by 2025, five Australian Army pilots are already gaining valuable experience with the platform through training and operations embedded within the U.S. Army. These pilots, all of whom have prior experience flying the ARH Tiger, are transitioning to the Apache at the U.S. Army Aviation Center of Excellence in Fort Novacell, Alabama, before being integrated into various U.S. Army combat aviation units. The transition from the ARH Tiger to the Apache presents notable changes. According to one Australian pilot with close to 1,000 flight hours on the Tiger, the AH-64E Apache offers increased armor, enhanced sensors, and superior firepower, even though it is heavier and requires more precise control in flight. The Apache can carry up to 16 Hellfire missiles, double the Tiger's load capacity, and features advanced targeting systems, infrared capabilities, a color display, and the powerful longbow radar. These upgrades allow the Apache to detect and engage targets from significantly greater distances, offering a strategic advantage over the Tiger in combat scenarios. Another crucial feature of the Apache is the Link 16 data sharing system, which allows for real-time communication between the helicopter, other aircraft, and ground units, facilitating coordinated, precision strikes in complex battlefield environments. Additionally, the Apache is set to integrate the Spike missile alongside the Hellfire, further enhancing its versatility in future combat operations. The Australian pilots embedded in U.S. units stationed in Hawaii, Washington, Kentucky, and Alabama are gaining first-hand experience flying the latest version of the Apache, which will be key to shaping the future Apache doctrine for the Australian Army. Their exposure to U.S. Army tactics, especially in Apache formations that rely on mixed radars and receivers for targeting data, will be instrumental in optimizing the helicopter's use in Australian operations. By 2025, Australia will receive 29 AH-64E Apaches, which will replace the aging ARH Tiger fleet. In the meantime, the Tiger will continue to serve in operational roles, but the lessons learned from flying the Apache will ensure a smooth transition and bolster Australia's future attack helicopter capabilities.